Come now, Alice. It's only a dream. Now. Focus. Wait. You're floating again. Weightless. A cipher. Relax. Forget it. Abandon that memory. It's unproductive. Go to Wonderland. No, Alice. Discard that delusion. Forget it. Go to Wonderland. Your preference doesn't signify, girl. Now, Alice, where are you? Change is good. It's the first link in the chain of forgetting. I'm not mad. That's not right. What's he doing there? Don't struggle, Alice. Let the new Wonderland emerge. Forget it, Alice. Block that dream. Wake at the sound. There, Alice. Better now, aren't we? Yes, well, the cost of forgetting is high. Remember other things. I'll set you free, Alice. Memory is a curse more often than a blessing. And I will say again, the past must be paid for. Now, before our next session, collect those pills from our high street chemist. Now, Charlie. Your pa was hung for killing your ma who beat you. Let's forget that, shall we? The past is dead, Charlie. The miserable hovel, the family that wasn't, they never were. You're home now, Charlie. Relax. You're floating. Listen. They're gone. Worst is over. And over. And over. Forget it, Alice. Forget it. Come now, Alice. Am I not to be as much honoured and obeyed as the Queen? Is that asking too much? I want what she wanted. Give yourself over to that. Trade the tentacles for the train. It's altogether a better ride. It's that or back to Rutledge. Is that asking too much? I want what she wanted. You are almost there. Almost free from what you fear. You could have been cured. You could have forgotten. They are dead. And you should be too. I provide a service. In the great and awful metropolis, appetites of all sorts must be gratified. The train is your invention, your defense. I merely set its schedule and itinerary. The train is coming with its shiny cars, with comfy seats and wheels of stars. So hush, my little ones, have no fear. The man in the moon is the engineer. As you wish, it will be. You're lost, and where your body is, your mind will follow. Perhaps it's already there. A declaration of their pedigree. You could use one. They're proud to display their provenance. <laughs> Not enough. Yours would have been a triumph. Still, you're an insane wreck. My work is done. No, the damage is done. The old Alice and her Wonderland retreat are demolished. You can't even recognize what's happened, and you're powerless to change it or move against me. I've made certain of that. I could have made you into a tasty bit, clients out the door waiting for a piece from a raving delusional beauty with no memory of the past or no sense of the future. But you wouldn't forget. You insisted on holding on to your fantasies. You're mad! Like your sister. Your sister was a tease, pretended to despise me. She got what she wanted, in the end. Oh, I hardly think so, Alice. You're powerless against me. In any case, you're known for your failure to distinguish fantasy from reality. Your imagination will destroy you. Hide in your shell! The past must be paid for. The cost of forgetting is high. Ineffectual twit! Absurd pugilist! Pretender! Make-believe avenger! Could you kill a fly? Cowardly worm! Frightened of your shadow? Insignificant ant! Don't struggle, Alice! Ineffectual twit! Could you kill a fly? Cowardly worm! Insignificant ant! Indeed. A hysterical woman, former lunatic, roaring outrageous accusations against a respectable social architect and scientist. My God, Alice, who would believe you? I scarcely believe it myself. By whom? By what? Psychotic, silly bitch. Your madness will be punished. Now leave. I'm expecting your replacement. Oh! <sighs> A flower's purpose is simple and immutable. Human purpose is fickle, because it is a slave to memory. Memories must be strictly managed, Alice. Unproductive ones must be eliminated.
Unpleasantness, remote in time and space, has only as much power as vivid memory offers it. Keep troubles and torments at a distance where they may be easily forgotten. The railway running through Wonderland sounds charming but inefficient. Noise and smoke, like snips and snails perhaps. Best to forget that train. A mock turtle as conductor, oh no, I don't think that will do at all. Some insects eat their young, Alice. They have much to teach us, alive or dead. Grave news. The ship was crushed and her crew lost. She was not built for navigating the Arctic ice fields. The recent competition of governments in fitting out polar expeditions is a needless waste of human life. What Nurse Whitless said was, The fire whooshed in, lit her up like the guy on Cracker Night. No one knows how she survived except Alice, and she's stoom, remember? <laughs> Lovers often exchange a lock of hair to symbolize their vows. The human heart is opened by a vast assortment of keys. Flush the unpleasant from your mind, Alice. Reject the painful as you would the repulsive and depraved. Forgetting is an art. Everything has a season, Alice. A flower blooms and fades away. Memories, too, have a useful life. We should eliminate the ones that hurt. Light? Light is useless if what it illuminates causes pain and suffering. Better to cast such things into the dark depths of Lethe, the river of forgetfulness. Balance is the golden mean of all things, Alice, between light and dark, between disease and health, or even between wrong and right. Damaged people feed on the emotions of others, Alice, their strengths and weaknesses. The proofs are legion. Every creature has a purpose. It is my sacred duty to fit every young person to a calling, be it for ornament or use. Read your history. Read your mythology. Remaking children. Build them up, tear them down, refashion them. Teach them the new, forget the old. Every child has a purpose. It is the beholden duty of knowing adults to fit every young person to her calling. 